Well, good morning, and uh, thank you, Congressman Foster, for uh, uh, being here with us today, and thank you, for uh, Mar Martha, for your leadership in making today possible. Uh, thank you all for being here to uh, experience it with us. Uh, this is an exciting time for North Central College and for our whole community. Uh, we are fortunate to be part of the vibrant city of Naperville, uh, one of the country's best cities to live and work in. And I'm thrilled that we're in a position today uh, to be much more intentional in connecting the college in the business sector, to find new and innovative ways to strengthen our region. I've known since I became president of this institution on January 1st of 2013 that it has a special connection to entrepreneurship through its alumni, its trustees, its faculty and students, and quite frankly, the amazing community all around us. I knew the college had tremendous uh, potential to build on its already strong programs. The truth is, entrepreneurship has always been part of North Central College's DNA. If you go back to the early years of this institution, and now I'm talking about the 1800s, our commercial program, as it was called, was a thriving part of our curriculum. In fact, the most influential uh, and popular text in the country on how to run a business was written by a North Central College professor. Throughout our history, many North Central students and alumni have gone on to become successful entrepreneurs. And our graduates' business acumen is in no way confined to our business programs. Uh, I'm not at all surprised that many of our entrepreneurs uh, didn't major in business. In fact, many of North Central's great business success stories were science majors. So I know the new science center that's going on uh, right around the corner here will also act as a bridge between the college and the business community. Consider two of our renowned alumni. Myron Wentz, for whom this beautiful hall is named, was a biology major before he founded Goal Laboratories. Uh, there he developed the first commercially available test for diagnosing one of the world's most common infectious diseases. And Roger Ruby, a chemistry major, founded CFC International, a special chemistry, a chemical company, and has gone on to start many other companies and has been inducted into the Chicago Area Entrepreneurship Hall of Fame. And I could go on and on and on with examples. Our more recent campus story centers on the work of legendary faculty like Gary Ernst, the Coleman Foundation Professor Emeritus of Entrepreneurship and Small Business, who established our award-winning Students in Free Enterprise, uh, was called SIFE, now called Enactus. Over the years, the Coleman Foundation awarded significant grant funding to Dr. Ernst for entrepreneurship education. Gary also launched our Self-Employment in the Arts Conference, an entrepreneurship institute, and built the curriculum for North Central College's entrepreneurship and small business management major. And we're fortunate to have our current faculty uh, sprinkled at different points in our, our room here today that are teaching our students today in these disciplines. This center that we are launching is also vitally important to me on a personal level. The truth is when I left MIT with my physics PhD, the opportunities that excited me the most were entrepreneurial. But I first accepted a consulting position at McKinsey because I thought it would round out my knowledge and expertise in business, and it, and it did that. But when I left McKinsey, I helped start a material science company called Plextronics in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Uh, and that was a great fit for me because like all entrepreneurs, I like wearing a lot of different hats. And every entrepreneur has to wear, have to have, has to have a closet full of hats to wear. At small startups, you're responsible for everything. I did everything from leading technology development to securing support from angel investors and venture capital firms to securing our first joint development agreements and ultimately our first customers. I know firsthand what it's like to pitch an idea to 100 potential investors to get that one to sign and come on board. When I left Plextronics, I worked with a highly entrepreneurial energy company in Chicago until it was acquired. 
And here I am now, a college president who is also a scientist and businessman and entrepreneur. So with the context that I've described, we have an incredibly fertile ground on which to launch a center for innovation and entrepreneurship. And this is the perfect time to do so. And Martha Carney is the perfect person to lead it. Our space in downtown Naperville will be a bridge and a conduit. It will be a bridge to the community, helping people start or grow a business through mentoring, practical instruction by entrepreneurs, and through business introductions. And it will be a conduit for North Central students to engage in entrepreneurial thinking through immersion in the startup mindset and creating awareness and access to sustainable funding. We see several goals being achieved through that facility. We will facilitate the connection of the business community to a network of mentors and resources that can help accelerate or grow their business. We will help foster a climate of entrepreneurship in downtown Naperville through a state-of-the-art business accelerator and co-working space. And we will expose North Central students to experiential learning through paid internships and pathways to full-time jobs with startups. This center really becomes a sort of nexus of uh, activity for our students, for our faculty, our alumni, local entrepreneurs, investors, and the Naperville community at large. So I'm thrilled today that we launch Converge, our business accelerator and co-working space in the heart of downtown Naperville. And I welcome Scott Boyer, president and founder of OWP Pharmaceuticals, who is Converge's first tenant. We're delighted to be helping you launch your company, Scott, while immersing North Central students in the entrepreneurial mindset. We know you'll succeed brilliantly. At the same time, we want uh, a separate name to capture the faculty and student-led activities that provide services for both internal and external constituents, whether that's market analysis or website assistance, perhaps social media assistance, software development, a myriad of other opportunities for our faculty and students. We will support creative and innovative thinking by students across all of the academic disciplines, whether it's in business or in STEM fields or in the arts, all while lowering barriers to starting new businesses right here at North Central, at North Central College. And we will create a mechanism for alumni to stay engaged and to support North Central College. So for that, we are proud to announce the name, the name Cardinal Launch for these faculty and student-led activities. What an exciting day for North Central College. With Converge and Cardinal Launch and the activities that uh, will be uh, led uh, by Martha Carney and our faculty, uh, in our facility here on campus in the Rawl House and with downtown uh, facility in River Square and possibly more to come in the future. It's an exciting day for North Central College. So many thanks to the inspired leadership of Martha Carney. We have very exciting plans for the future. Collaborators like the Naperville Development Partnership and Naperville Chamber of Commerce have also been key to the development of this ambitious effort. We are all looking forward to, as is the slogan for our capital campaign right now, a brilliant future. So thank you for your attendance today, and thank you for your interest in being part of that brilliant future here at North Central College. Thank you.